What is up YouTube? Clickwood here back again on Madden 15 Ultimate Team and today guys what I want to do is try and pull this brand new Peyton Manning limited time only record breaking Peyton Manning. It looks absolutely ridiculous. I showed you guys in a review earlier this afternoon what I thought about this card, why I think it's the best offensive player in the game, definitely the best quarterback. So what I want to do like I said is try and open this thing up. So what I'm going to do is open up 10 pro packs here guys and we'll see what we can do. Let's hop right into it. First card, Brandon Bear. Come on. I haven't had good luck in quite some time. Orlando Skandrick, okay. That's not a very good pack. Uh, let's continue and on here and try and get another card or another uh, pack here. Like I said, I just haven't had much luck whatsoever opening packs lately, and it's just been so painful to just sit and pull these low 70 overall gold cards. JR Sweezy, oh boy. Just nothing of value once again. It's just, it's almost becoming comical at this point that I'm just not able to pull anything even moderately decent. Oh, and if you guys are wondering how I went from, like, what was it, like 70,000 to 270,000 coins, um, I actually sold a ton of silver, bronze, and gold items. Uh, I went on the full grind. Oh, we get a Zach Martin Football Outsiders. Nice. Finally, we get something decent. That's at least a solid pull. Uh, pretty happy about that. Uh, let's take a look here at my other right guard. I think he's probably going to be my starter. Oh, Larry Warford's my other starter, though. My budget right guard. Oh, no. They're the same at run block. Warford's better at, at pass block. He's better at impact block. Uh, Martin's better at strength. I might end up selling this Zach Martin just because I think Larry Warford is probably a better value. So I can probably get more for Zach Martin than I can for Larry Warford, and they're pretty similar as far as attributes go. So I'm probably going to sell Zach Martin, and uh, I'm pretty happy about getting that, though. That's nice. That's a nice, nice pull. I'm happy about it. I have no idea what it's going for right now. Uh, but anyways, I was talking about what I did to uh, actually acquire so many coins. Um, like I said, first of all, I sold a ton of uh, of smaller overall cards, like your 70 overalls and these stupid things that I've been pulling for, uh, you know, like the Steven Nicholas, for example. A lot of people will just quick sell this card. I'll go on and actually go through the full grind. You know, I'll sell it for 1,200 coins or, you know, whatever it's going for just because I know that I'm getting, you know, a slight bump up in coins every time that I do that. And over time, that's just going to add up for you. I did it, like I said, on my silvers as well. I went from having a thousand items in my binder down to about 300. So that's how I did it. Um, I did also have a couple of rare silvers that I had pulled. So that helped out as well. Um, and then the other thing too, was that I had a friend actually give me 100,000 coins just because he wanted to. He, he's had such great luck opening stuff and um, he asked me if if I would accept 100,000 coins if he gave them to me and I was like, I guess, yeah, I mean, that's cool. Thank you for offering to do that. I don't get offered to get free stuff often, guys, so that was very nice of him. Uh, if you guys want to send him a follow, his Twitter is at EA is awesome. Yeah, I wonder why he's getting juice packs. I wonder why he's getting juice packs with a, a Twitter handle like that as we pull a mod black, a garbage card. Uh, not much here in this pack, unfortunately, although we do get the blue Dallas Cowboys jerseys, which is what I used through all of Madden 25. And it's nice, though, when you're opening up these packs like this, guys, you end up just actually getting to, um, you know, you, you start to collect things that you need for some of those sets, like the jersey sets or the, um, you know, the stadium sets, the playbooks, that kind of stuff, coaches, you know, all these type of things, they all add up, and then you get those, uh, uh, what are they called, the badge packs, yeah, they, and then uh, you're able to actually flip those if you get anything solid in those, you know, whether it be a uh, gold badge or I pulled an elite badge in one of them, so that was pretty epic, um, but yeah, I mean, it's not all these cards that you pull are just completely garbage, although look at these, I all I get is low overall golds, I swear, um, I, I can't really complain too much because of that Zach Martin, but I mean, I don't know that that Zach Martin's going for an ex extraordinary amount right now. So, you know, it kind of sucks that I'm just throwing away coins once again. Here we are again. Although I had just been throwing away points, aka money, into the game and not pulling anything. So uh, at least this time I'm only getting, uh, or I'm only putting in some, uh, some coins. 
coins into this one, but Stefan Gilmore is actually a pretty solid card. I, I think I actually already have him on my team, so I'm probably going to end up selling him, but his attributes are actually pretty good if you, if you take a look at him. Um, he's got some solid stuff, like, for example, let's see here. If I remember, his man coverage is pretty... It's either his man coverage or his zone is pretty good. Uh, yeah, so it's actually a decent combination, 86 and 89. I mean, if you consider the fact that he's an 81 overall item, it's it's not too bad. So, uh, I definitely think that this one is worth using. If I didn't already have him on my team, I probably would keep him. But, uh, 92 speed too, so... Alright, I'll probably end up selling him, and just like I said, guys, it's cards like that that kind of add up over time if you just if you don't quick sell them if you just go on to the auction block and grind it out you can get some decent coins in return for these items they will sell if you put them as the lowest priced item oh and we get a jason morrow rising stars i think i already have one of these so maybe i can add it together and get that upgraded jason morrow that would be pretty decent because um I, although i do really like my tight ends because i've got jordan cameron and jared cook I'm kind of stacked at tight end, I feel like. That's kind of a weird thing to say, but you know what? I use my tight ends a lot in Madden, as you guys are well aware from Madden 25 when I was using Donald Penns and Vernon Davises. Um, so I, I definitely like to see that Jason Morrow. I don't know that, that, I don't think that card really goes for a whole lot, but it'll pretty much pay for the pack at least. So that's uh, not too bad. And once we add them together, we can get that upgraded version. So I definitely like seeing that. Got what, two more packs here, I think? Uh, if I counted wrong, sorry about that, guys. The intention was to buy 10. Uh, Chance Warmack, there you go, Ryan and uh, and my other buddies that are Titans fans. Look at this guy. Just just trolling. Look at that face. He's just trolling. <laughs> and, uh, I, love that. I love that he was taken in the top 10 and the Titans fans were so excited about it. And I'm just sitting there going, dude, you guys are drafting a guard in the top 10. And then my Cowboys drafted like a third round player in the first round at the end of the first round. And I was just like, bruh, bruh. But it turns out though that he's actually been pretty solid. Uh, so, you know, could be it could be worse. Uh, Travis Frederick was the pick that we made there. Anyways, guys, we've got one more. And we'll, uh, we'll hope here that we somehow pull this Peyton Manning. I would absolutely shit bricks if I pull this Peyton Manning. I'm telling you guys. If you see red and it's Peyton Manning, I'm going to absolutely poop. And Jacob Tammy. Oh, well. Ah, at least it was somebody on the Broncos. You know what? I think, I think that might be a sign, guys. I think I might need to open up one more pro pack. One more pro pack. Come on. Give me this Peyton, Lamar Houston. Damn it. Son of a bee. All right. Well, anyways, guys, that is going to do it for today's pack opening video. I did fall under 200,000 coins now. And this is why you don't open up packs. No, I'm just joking, guys. Uh, I did get a couple decent items in here at least. I, I'm sure that I lost coins because I spent 75 or you know 82,500 or whatever it was on packs. So hopefully you guys have a little bit better luck than I do with these pack openings because it has been so rough for me lately, man. It's been just brutal, but I'm having a lot of fun playing. Um, we're going to be doing some more head-to-head -head season stuff over the next couple of days, so be on the lookout for that. Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. I do appreciate it, and I will talk to you beautiful bitches again soon.